Hi guys, Archie Luxury, and today guys, I'm very proud to introduce a new sponsor of the Archie Luxury and the Paul Pruder channels. Who am I talking about? Whatshopping.com, whatshopping.com, whatshopping.com. Check them out, guys. Jump online, check out whatshopping.com. These guys here have been in business since 2017. Worldwide shipping and distribution. Over 10,000 wristwatches in inventory. Stock in hand and 90 plus different brands, new and pre-owned. Now, the good thing about watchshopping.com, trusted by over 4,000 reviews on Chrono24 and Trustpilot. Your one-stop shop to buy any watch your heart desires. Please, guys, check out watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com, watchshopping.com. I'm Archie Luxury, and check out watchshopping.com. Hi guys, Archie Luxury on the Paul Pluter channel doing paid review 22 QA 27. This is for Daniel. Quick whist. He wants to remain anonymous. Yep, okay. How many Daniels are in the world? Daniel and the lion. Even my brothers. Okay, let's have a look here. I'm wristwatch check. I'm wearing a Rolex Submarina. Submarina 41 mil date. Here we go. Hi, Arch. I'm a long-time listener and fan. I've sent you $50 for a paid review, and I'm really looking forward to your thoughts on the below. Okay, here we go. I've built a three-way three -way collection that I'm happy with, but feel it has room to grow. Please see the attached pic. My Casio G-Shock as a beater, my 39mm Explorer for every day, and a Reverso Tribute as my dress piece. I want to build a... Classic collection and have some ideas how to take it forward. Take it forward. That I'd like to share with you as well as some overall watch collecting thoughts and concern. Number one, I like the idea of adding a... Okay, for starters, number one, guys, you've got a three-piece. This is not a three-piece collection. This is a two-piece. You don't include some bullshit Casio G-Shock. Man, come on, man. I can get a $20 petrol station watch and, man, that's not, that's, that's cheating, man. That's like buying subs, buying views on YouTube. It's not the way it's done. So you've got a two-piece collection there. Number one, I like the idea of adding a blue Seamaster 300 or a, and an IWC Portuguese chronograph in white. I see this is a great collection. I see this as a great collection that would have all the bases covered and I really like the variation. I'll have in dial color once achieved. Uh, Omega Seamaster 300. Okay. I would personally would rather the Lollipop Retro uh, Seamaster. IWC Portuguese Chronograph. No, add an Amiga Speedmaster. Don't add a bloody IWC. I know you're going to... Oh, number two. I know you're going to say Speedmaster, but I've had two men on the moons already and would like to try something different. Well, why did you sell them then? That's a stupid way to go. Plus, since I would like each watch to be from a different brand, I'll go for the Amiga Diver. That's a mistake. It's a dumb move as I've had no other real diver choice other than an unattainable sub. Okay. What about a Breitling Super Ocean Heritage? That's an amazing bang per buck diver. Amazing. On the shark mesh, absolutely amazing. It bothers me that I'll never have one. But with that said, I bought my Explorer at a time uh, when you could still kind of get a sub, and I'm happy with my choice. However, if I could get a sub, I'd definitely go for a moon watch again as my... Well, Jesus Christ, man. You wrap it on. Just make it happen. Make it so. Get a credit card, man. Visa, MasterCard. So, i got to tell you, definitely get the Speedmeister, man. And number three, my Rolex has gone up in value. So, well, this is... <laughs> 
My Rolex has gone up in value so much that wearing it kind of stresses me out and makes the experience on a man. What the fuck are you smoking, man? Part of me wants to sell it just to get rid of the anxiety and put the money towards an amic. Man, that's a dumb. That's called being a fucking idiot. I'd have a great collection and I'd be rid of the... Ro what the hell are you on, man? Rolex, burden and stigma? What the fuck? What the fuck? However, the Rolex has a lot of sentimental value as I bought it to celebrate a dream job. Fuck me, dead. Jobs are dreams. You gotta work for yourself. Dream job? Fuck me, dead. What do you think of my points about Rolex? I think you're a fucking idiot. That's what I think about your points on Rolex. My collection in general, and where should I take it? Well, the Casio isn't a fucking... The Casio is not a watch. You got a two piece. And where I should take, well, you should add more. Add more, man. This collection's two crummy pieces. I mean, what the, what the hell is that? That's not a collection. And of course, thank you for all your videos and entertainment over the years. I really appreciate it. Kind regards. Man, what the fuck are you on, man? What the fuck are you on? Seriously, if I were you, I would, I would be, I would be adding a Breitling Super Ocean Heritage. It could be a Heritage One or it could be a Heritage Two. I don't give a fuck. Add that as your diver. Add a Omega. Maybe get a first Omega in space. You want something different? Get a first Omega in space. Don't get a fucking. What were you looking at? And I put. Don't get the IWC. Um, what else would I do there, man? Don't sell the rand. That, that's just pussy. That's just shit. I never heard so much bullshit in my life. I get people writing to me every day of the week saying they can't get a Rolex. Can't get it. And you've got anxiety? Fike me, Dad. What the hell? Let's go, Brandon. Come on, man. That's not a damn problem. Man, I don't understand. Understand it, man. I, I, I really, 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 really don't understand what you are bitching about, man. You should be so lucky. I, I don't know what to say. I really don't know what to say. I don't know what to say, man. There are some ungrateful sons of bitches out there. That's all I can say, man. I don't understand. Most people are grateful to have a Rolex. You're witching about anxiety. It's loser germs if you sell the Rolex. You're going to sell the Rolex and get what? An Omi? That's just loser talk for I'm too fucking lazy to do a second and third job. That's what it is. You're too fucking lazy to do a second and third, fourth job, man. Nobody said this is easy. If you wanted an easy, why don't you go and collect more Casios? That's what I don't like about this. You've taken the shortcuts in life. You can't add a Casio and say, I got a three piece, three piece. Bullshit you got. You got two lousy watches and a piece of crap. And then you want to sell the Rolex? What the? I never heard so much dog shit in my life. What is wrong with you, man? So I got to be honest with you, man up, own it, own it, own it, man. This is just bullshit. Uh, I, so I, I'm disappointed in you. How, so many people can't get a Rolex. You're an ungrateful son of a bitch. Ungrateful. Why would you say I got anxiety? Man, nobody, nobody's ever happy in this world, are they? Hey, eh? I, 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 I cannot believe it man i could not make this shit up there's no way in the world i could make this shit up man you think too much thinking too much don't psychoanalyze everything man to watch just wear the viking thing don't i i don't understand this psychoanalytic crap what the fuck are you on man i Gotta be honest with you, man. It's disappointing. Man up! Man up! Man the fuck up and go forward. That's what I would say. So, there you go. I've given the advice. 
whether you follow it or not, it's up to you, man. But don't, I just can't believe, don't sell the Rolex, the Ro you got anxiety. That's loser talk. That is loser talk. Loser talk, man. You don't, don't talk like, that's loser talk. Loser, loser, I get loser germs from thinking about that, man. How could you be, I, I, I don't understand, ungrateful, son of a bitch. I can't believe this bullshit. Can you, if this is, I, I could not. Make this shit up, man. You gotta be grateful. You got a Rolex 39 mil. Sort of saying, I'm so lucky. You just, I got anxiety. Fuck me, dead man. What the hell is wrong with you? Man up. Man up and seize it by the balls. That's what you need to do, man. None of this pussy footing around. And the Omega, get the Omega. First Omega in space. Forget the IWC. IWC, you're gonna get loser germs. Loser germs, okay? Don't don't do that. Loser germs. Man, I, I just can't believe it. Get the Breitling Super Ocean Heritage. That's an amazing diver. It uses the Tudor movement. The Tudor movement. The Tudor movement that's in the Black Bay. That's right. That's what I would do, man. There you go. That's the advice from your pontiff. You can listen to me or you can just turn it off. I don't know, man. I don't know what to say. Okay, guys, like, subscribe, tell your friends. I will see you in the next one. Don't forget, guys, I operate in a very small niche. Without your support, I would sink. I desperately need your support to survive. Please get a paid review done now. Also sponsor me on Patreon and I will see you in the next one. Can't understand he gets anxiety from having a Rolex. What absolute bullshit. Hi guys, it's Archie Luxury. Guys, I wanna to talk to you about David SW. David SW, David SW. Guys, if you are in America, if you are looking for a Rolex watch of your dreams, in fact, if you're looking for a contemporary modern wristwatch, I strongly advise you to look at David SW. Guys, don't play the dealer games. Don't bring in chocolates or crispy creams for your dealer hoping to get a Rolex at retail. It's futile. Please guys, save your dignity. Keep some pride. Go to David SW. I would highly recommend David SW, David SW. If you're in America and you're looking for a watch, go to David SW, David SW, David SW. Hey guys, Archie Luxury on the YouTube sensation, the Paul Pluto channel. Guys, I need you to help me out, guys. I can't survive on Google Ads alone. I need you to request a paid review. 50 US dollars, look down in the description. 
50 US dollars. Are we, I will review your collection. I'll tell you what I think of it and I'll give you some pointers. The other thing is, guys, you can sponsor me on Patreon. Patreon allows you to pay a couple bucks a month, a dollar, two dollars, five dollars, whatever you want. And it keeps me going on YouTube because, guys, I'm in a niche. Nobody can make money out of the views I get. The views are crap because it's a small, specialized area. And I don't talk about garbage for the sake of views. Guys, sponsor me on Patreon. Look down below and I will see you in the next one. Yeah.